All right, so today we're gonna be updating the BIOS on this MSI B550 VC Wi-Fi board. In case you don't know how to update your BIOS, let's get into it. All right, so the first thing that you're gonna need is a USB. USB is in the computer and it just popped up. You don't have to have an empty USB. However, just for simplicity, it is nice. Uh, go to properties and then as you can see here, make sure it's in FAT32 not XFAT, not NTFS, it has to be in FAT32. If not, you're gonna have to format your USB and then proceed with the next step. So the next thing is, you wanna go ahead and search for this exact same motherboard on Google. If you don't have the box and you don't remember which motherboard you have, you can easily type in system information and on here, you can see the exact model under baseboard product. It says Pro B550M-VC Wi-Fi. And then the first link that comes up is the MSI link. Go ahead and click it and go to the support tab. All right, so in the support tab, you're gonna to wanna to scroll down BIOS firmware and you'll see a bunch of different BIOSes on the screen. I can see that the first one, it does say beta version. So you can download it, but personally, I don't like to test out anything first, just in case you don't want any problems. So go for the one just below it. Go ahead and click download. And once it downloads up, click the folder. You'll see that it's always in a compressed zip folder. So you're gonna to wanna to go ahead and extract all. Perfect, so now you have it here in your downloads. After that, you're gonna wanna go ahead and drag it to your USB, just like that. It's gonna copy right over. And when you click on your USB, you'll see the folder and the actual BIOS right in there. Once you've done all these steps, the next thing that you should do is go ahead and restart your PC. All right, so now that we have the PC fully restarting, I'm waiting for it to get back up, and I wanna spam that delete key. If you don't go into BIOS right away, then you wanna go ahead and restart your computer again and just keep spamming that delete key until you're in the BIOS, just like this. Perfect. So now we're in the BIOS and go over here, just on the bottom corner, you're gonna see something called M Flash. Different motherboards are gonna be different, but for this MSI B550, you're gonna see M Flash right here. System will auto reboot and enter flash mode. Do you wanna enter flash mode? Yes. Perfect, so now we're in, and you'll see here we have a directory or a folder, 7C9, make sure it's the right one. Go ahead and click that, click the other directory, and over here we can see E7C95AMS. So this is the correct file that we wanna go ahead and select. Click yes, and now the BIOS is updating. Like I said before, BIOS updates can take five, 10 minutes, and you really don't wanna mess around with it too much while it's updating, so just, go out, grab a coffee, grab a water, come back, and hopefully it's done. So let's wait until this loads and we'll come right back. And just like that with the USB, we've manually updated our BIOS. It went ahead, it shut everything down, restarted itself, and now we're back in Windows. Everything's fully functional and we're good. Until next time guys, thank you so much. Please leave us a comment, please like, and I hope you guys learned something and how to update your BIOS. Till next time, a peace.